So apparently Google has improved Gemini in Android Studio to a real agent now. So let's find out to what length it can really code an Android project. Let's try to create a simple chat app. Create a new project, give it a name chat app, then wait for it to compile. After it's done, open Gemini from the right tab and make sure it's in agent mode. Then now let's give it a simple prompt. Let's ask it to create a simple app with a green message bubbles. So as you can see, it says, okay, I'll help you create a simple chat application with green message bubbles. To start, I'll create a message data class to represent a chat message. Then I'll create the UI. First, I need to understand your project structure to find the best place to add the new files. After it is done, it says, I see the project has a UI package and a main activity.kt. I'll create a new package called data to hold the data models. And as you see, it starts to make changes to the project. It creates a messages data class with the author and the message body. It then creates a message card to show how the messages will be displayed on the screen with a text for author and a text for the message. Then inside the main activity, it puts everything together while using sample messages. After it's done, it says, I've added the green color to your theme. Now your message card will use this color. I have created a simple chat application with green message bubbles as you requested. Please let me know if you would like any other changes. Let's run the app and see what it looks like. As you can see, this is what it has done, but let's tell it to make some few changes to make it look better. So we give it a prompt, telling it that we want the user to be able to add messages using text editor, remove the sample messages, also use a dull green color with white text and give the messages some padding from the side, uh, add a toolbar as well. Now let's see what it has done. Let's run the app again. As you can see, there's some changes made. The green bubble is now a bit clearer. The messages are visible, but now we want the messages to begin from the bottom, right? Just like any other messaging app. So let's tell it to make these changes. Now let's wait and see what it has done. Let's run the app. Let me now try to send a message. Boom, as you can see. Now the messages are beginning from the bottom right. So basically, it is not a bad coding agent. It can listen to commands and do a requested. But how far can it go? You can push it to the limit and see how far it can go. But don't forget to always describe what exactly you want. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more like this.